the last eight, nine months has been very lonely. Um, when you talk about some of the problems that are happening in China, and unfortunately, the, the organization that I played in, um, yes, it was, a, it was a very tough time. So that's what I will say. That's what I will leave, leave with it. But uh, the people that I call my brothers, I'm referring to my teammates. You know, I had hundreds of teammates. I played 11 years in the league. Not one of them answered my text uh, messages right now because of, yeah. Because they were scared so much, if I do an interview and if I give their name, they will lose sponsorships, yep. jersey sales, or shoe sponsors, whatever it is. But you know, I told them, this is bigger than basketball, this is bigger than NBA, this is bigger than ourselves. While we are... <laughs> while we are dribbling a basketball in this country, on the other side of the world, people are losing their lives, losing their homes, and losing their loved ones. Yeah. So we have to stand up for those innocent people. 前 NBA 球员坎特勇于对中国人权议题发声，也多次公开表态挺台湾与挺香港。